Okay, shit. Um, I'm here a couple minutes early, so I get some predictions out. All right. So obviously, I want Prime Four. Literally anything about Prime Four. Prime Two, you bastard. You know, because I feel like they're going to drop all three Prime games, the trilogy, before they even, you know, hint at dropping a release date for 4. So, like, maybe a gameplay trailer for Prime 4. Prime 2 remastered, or maybe just a port of 2, because I remember them saying, like, leakers saying that uh, Prime 2 is coming later this year, but it's not going to be as polished as Prime 1. Or Prime Remastered. But I also want some side order stuff. Stuff about Splatoon 3 DLC, the side order. It's been long enough, so please. Um, I mean, I'm going to be a little wacky and wild, but a new Star Fox game? New Star Fox would be so dope. That would go so hard. Like, Star Fox HD on a Switch? I mean, I like Zero or Star Fox Zero. I'm about the only person who does. But a new Star Fox would go so hard. Kid Icarus would be clean. I keep hearing stuff about Bayonetta DLC, Bayonetta 3 DLC. I don't think that's gonna happen. But if it does, god damn it, I want it. Um shit. Oh my god. Maybe this is when they finally announce an export or Dino Saga something. I don't know. But oh my god. Oh shit, it's starting. Okay, let's go. Oh my god, okay, let's go, let's go! Oh, the devil's wrecked! Oh fuck, oh fuck. Nintendo Direct. Nintendo Direct. Nintendo Direct. Oh my god, and then they start off with side order. Oh my god, I was just saying that. Okay. Oh shit, side order. Good. Okay. Oh, look at those dualies! Look at those dualies! Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck is- Oh my god, what is this? What? What? Oh my god, we got damage numbers now? But this e Octoleague's all grown up. Wait, was that- Tower control- Was that the tower? Dead fish? What is that fish doing here? Oh my god. Dead fish! Let's go! Wait, is she is she back to make the music? Cause her octo wait, not like dead fish. Hold on. Wait, Pearl Pearl and Marina? Wait, that little f that's Pearl? What the fuck happened to her? Where wait, where's Marina? Oh my god. What is this? Splash damage run speed? Wait, wait, wait! Splash damage? Oh my god, this looks amazing! Two wings, right? Are they bringing Splash down back? Bro, what are these new dualies? Whoa, whoa, those were new, newer dualies? They look like different. What the fuck is this expansion? Side order, this is, looks way better than Octo Expansion. Oh my god, what? Hello everyone, I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Oh my Direct. god, that was great! It's the off rip with you just that! saw a new trailer for Wave 2 of the Splatoon off Expansion Pass DLC, Side Order. Oh yeah, I'm doing a trailer analysis this for this story on my second channel. Spire of Order, where you will strengthen your character's abilities as you ascend the Spire's floor. Oh my god. We're developing this single player DLC so it can be played over and over again. Yes. How Pearl, what happened to her? Where's Marita Spring? To her? Where's Marita so spring? To Damn. At least we got a release date. That's the next okay, year. Let's Fuck. see our first batch of Nintendo Switch <laughs> okay, Let's go, let's go. What is this? Dino Saga. The toys are back in town. What? What is this shit? Donkey Kong. Mario. Here we go. The rivalry that heated up Mario on the Game Boy Advance DK. system reignites on the Nintendo Switch system. With his eyes mean? on the prize. Oh, is this like a remake of Donkey, Donkey Kong, the original like arcade game? From the factory. <laughs> 
and it's up to Mario to track him down. Well, I mean, I don't think this is the type of DK game people wanted, but at Any least stage, it's something. Contraptions? Expand on. I don't know if you want this, but observation and action are vital to your success. Oh my God, bro! I just want to go back and watch that side order trailer. What? Cross the gap. Hmm. I want to watch that, that side order trailer. Tail looks a little suspicious, though, doesn't it? If Mario I was not expecting this, him to climb like that. You know what this looks across. like? This looks like one of them uh, Game and Watch Safety games. What? <laughs> this looks like a Game and Watch game. Platform too high? Reach it with a handstand jump or a What the fuck was that? Like that? What? I mean, sure, Observe I guess. And act to collect mini Mario's, clear stages, <laughs> and face Donkey Kong head on. We need to get the music and everything. In this updated version of the game, you can play with a friend in local co op. Oh my god, bro, that side through, order trailer. It's up to you to recover the oh toys. my shit. Mario vs. Donkey Kong launches on Nintendo oh Switch my February 16th. Pre-orders begin today. Oh my Nintendo god, that's Wii that order trailer. I can't. Oh my god, I want that. I want to watch that again. Save the prince and the world. Prince of Persia? Oh shit. Prince of Persia remake. Sargon as he sets off to save the prince of Persia and restore the world's balance. I never Tapping cared the roots or the played this game. Series. Never this cared game about or played this game. But I, I recognized it off rip. Dash through breathtaking I don't know how, but I did. Persian inspired world. But don't linger too long if you hope to survive. Harness sword and bow techniques, as well as time powers to best these hostile lands. As your journey progresses, Sargon will grow stronger and learn new abilities that expand his arsenal. Oh, Equip that tree, that was some Ori shit. That looks like other perks. The, the, the number of spirit trees is limited, though, of Ori. So choose wisely. Use everything at your disposal to navigate this harsh world and defeat the mythical beast. We're going to get a Silk Song trailer that get everyone's been crying about for like the past the year. Or at least a release date. When Prince of Persia, the Lost Crown, launches on the Nintendo Switch system January 18th. You can receive the in-game Warrior funny. Within outfit by I haven't played the game from Nintendo Hollow Knight. Or maybe I will someday, but it's funny. Everyone wants These Silk Song. will help you chase your, passion. your passions. Like blaze your glory. That's some Twitter shit. In Horizon Chase Two, speed through stunning environments, each with its own dynamic. Got Horizon while Chase Two. Your rivals on the road. Metroid Prime Play Two. Play the main campaign to unlock vehicles, courses, and more. You can also oh my God! But why? Why did they do that? How did they do that? Needs. They. Why did they off rip? Action? Why did they off rip and just show us side order? Right? That's the first thing I said too online. on my predictions. Like, oh, I want some side order and stuff. And then they give us a whole stream. That Switch was so cool. Today. That was so dope. Apparently, that Warm floating thing is Pearl. Okay. So what happened to Marina? And, and why are they like robots? How did they? What? How did they get fucked? Away, or are they dead? Maybe they're not dead. Game. And that's like, a, like uh, a drone so that Pearl is using because her and Marina are kept captive. I didn't really get to read the dialogue, play. but maybe Pearl Super and Marina are held captive somewhere in that spire of order, and we gotta save them. And she's communicating with us through that drone and that act person that was definitely dead fish that, that was bro that was no worry that, that had to be on dead fish if she's just using class, an alias then enjoy family time in the evening like i know dead on fish but i see her that was dead fish what places, i like love her beach, octo expansion music in search of subjects so maybe she's making music for How will you spend or maybe your time that's with just and family. And a relative of dead fish i don't know dude Inklings and Octolings have Operation families. Memories launches on Nintendo they have Switch brothers and sisters year. and fathers and mothers. Mario's first RPG adventure returns. We already know about the this. Super Mario but a new trailer RPG is cool. Game is back with um, updated graphics. Let's um, go over some new and returning gameplay. Yeah, like features. what the fuck is happening with Pearl and Marina? 
time your button because I mean that will explain why they've been gone the whole game because we've seen Kelly and Marie never heard your shit about Pearl and Marina and, and, and now here they are also those fucking dualies bro those white dualies are so clean do we get to like have those in game once we beat um side order we can like play that play with those online multiplayer those white dualies are so clean bro they have to have some kind of special or some type of gimmick, During right? Your adventure, Maybe they got five rolls? Or they just shoot faster? After I don't know. They the game, look the same. Or maybe they're just hero dualies. And they're white this time. But, but not called hero dualies. Like, gonna be order? Order dualies? Wait! Since Splatoon 3 is based on, um... Set up the Splatfest of Chaos vs. Order and Chaos 1. Super Mario this DLC RPG is going to be based on order, on so it's just going to come full circle. That's so cool. Are That's so now cool. On e oh my god, side order. Oh my, bruh. Hey. Oh. What? Look wait, alive. wait. Do I know this? There. I do not. But, oh my god. <gasps> Side order looks. What were the those Nintendo like DS ghost fish things? Memory returns on the and, and where? System as another code to memories. And where does one day a young girl named the Spire of Order come from? Where are we? Because I know like away. all everything Seeking in Splatoon answers, from one, two, and three, they all the happen on like the same map. They're all in, in the same world. Him. But where the fuck is this Once order there, like Spire of Order shit? And Where's this tower at? Where's this whole area from? Cause it's all like white and it almost kind of looks like a simulation like what that was definitely dead fish i'm not letting that go that had to be i know they said the name was act or something but, but that has to be dead fish and she's using an alias to protect her identity or to help free pearl and marina from their captivity i'm, I'm sticking with that bro i'm sticking with that pearl and marina are trapped somewhere Who are you? and Pearl is using sequel, that another code drone journey into to communicate through and you see the new Octoly is also included she's so definitely like older Juliet, than huh? every other character in the series right or at least story. playable Unravel character or like you know the main characters not including Nintendo cuttlefish Switch, but like the idols code, and the playable characters we've had she looks older than Octo expansion um character I forgot what was that agent Eight? I, I don't know all the agents. Another code recollection includes two um, games, the Nintendo DS but, game Trace Fuck. Memory and Order looks so good. Never released in North Side America. Looks so good. I saw a triple link strike in there. It looked like at the end, like the last couple frames, they had like upgraded dualies. They look like at this. Look like Grisco dualies. Also, wait. What is this? Okay, wonder. New Super Mario Bros. DS remake. One day. A loyal toad presented a flyer. Oh wait, this is that Peach game. Oh shit, let's go. Oh god, I, I've Princess been I've been waiting for this. Some toads went to go see it. I want this but game. Then... Oh yeah, this is that Peach game. Let's go. Oh, I want to see the title of it. What's the, the name? The wicked grape and the sour bunch suddenly made their grand entrance and took center stage. Bro, a Super Princess Peach now, remake would be Peach so hard. Super Princess Peach is actually hella good. It's so fun. I actually like that game. This if this is a remake or like a sequel to that? Tragedy. And this is going to be a 2D side scroller? Can use the power of Stella's ribbon to face off against the sour yeah. bunch. Okay. It still looks cool though. I mean, we like Peach. We like Peach out here. The ribbon alone won't always cut it though. So let's do this. Okay, okay, we like that dress. Whoa, Peach whoa. transformed into Sword Fighter Peach. Oh, oh whoa, she's kind of she bad. What? Show-stopping abilities. Fend off the sour Look at that fit. Sensational sword Look play. at that. Oh my God, she's so like nimble and agile in that. Save this performance and its performers. Oh my shit. There are more stolen shows What's to called? save. Give me a name drop. Give me a title. Gone missing. Become detective. Oh, okay. Peach. Okay, Detective Peach, we like. We like those. Well, oh, this is actually so cool. 
desserts have been snatched from this I like that festival. detective peach outfit. Turn into patissier peach and patissier? save it from a sugar crash. The sour bunch got their hands on this martial arts school. Okay, we got all the Fu peach and take it back from these foul fiends. Kung Fu peach? Why she knows martial arts? That's Chun-Li stance, Many other kind of, right? I like the, the little curtains. reference, maybe. The or that's set. just a Our common stance. I'm not in the, the martial arts. I don't know. But this Peach game looks Princess so clean. Peach, showtime. Princess Peach, showtime. Oh, look at the title. The P has, like, her hair, too? Her ponytail? Oh, March? Damn, okay. They give us, like, a straight-out date. That was a new look at Princess Peach Showtime. In Peach's latest adventure, the gameplay changes depending on her transformations. It looks like there are more transformations beyond the ones we showed today, so please stay tuned. Let's continue with some more headlines. Yeah, let's go, let's go, Prime, Prime 4! A new saga begins. Sino <laughs> Saga? Wait, a multi I, I, I knew it, I knew it was not it, because like the title, or it said a new saga and the G was capitalized, but also like the font of saga, I already knew it wasn't Xeno Saga, but I was at maximum levels of cope, bro. Literally anything at this point would have made me believe. Alright, I wanted it, I wanted it, no Xeno Saga, fuck, She's, who's that? And a king of but yeah, it was, was too. It was too good to be true. A hero, then of course, the is it gonna be Zeno Saga? Why would I think that? As they strive to achieve their goals. Even if we don't get Zeno Saga, that fucking side How order trailer, holy shit! Your hands. A the side order you trailer. Unlock different paths. At least More you know it's coming out the spring the next year. Franchise. Fight in timeline battles. Turn-based combat in which turn order is crucial to victory. Turn order. Use special Side techniques order? to control the order of actions, or activate team combos to swing the tide okay, of battle that? in your favor. Saga Emerald Beyond. Launches How about our Xeno Saga? Next year. Emerald Beyond. I don't know. Prime. The legendary Raider returns. Oh, Lara Croft remake? That's cool. The first three Tomb Raider games, all with upgraded visuals, are venturing oh, it's a trilogy pack. in one daring collection. As the fearless archaeologist, Lara Croft, we're gonna get goddamn Tomb Raider trilogy, but not the Metroid Prime trilogy. Or, you know, better Prime, yet, the Xeno Saga trilogy. And swan what? Come on, bro. Spanning different countries Demco, please. And Demco, please. Along the way, you'll solve puzzles to uncover treasures of the ancient world and unravel mysteries lost to the ravages of time. All right. This faithful they have remastered to trilogy comes with dumper, all of the expansions though. and secret levels for each game. You can also toggle between the original polygon look and the upgraded that visuals That is so at any cool. Time. I like see. Tomb I Raider love features like that. You can either play in the original on the or Switch like the HD 14. version. See, I've always like, I've always uh, like imagined and wondered about that, but no one's ever this really done it. Got a second bolt I was like, brilliance. oh, wouldn't it be cool if we could like play an original graphics and then the Every HD? But I never expected anyone to actually do that. I, I love that City, feature. I actually really like that feature. I, I wish the more like remakes had Pikachu that. And his partner it, it'd be so dope. Investigate various cases. While searching for Harry, he's Tim's still voiced by Ryan father. Reynolds. Ooh, she's ooh, whoa. Tim is, he, is Pikachu people. still voiced Pikachu by Ryan Reynolds? Pokemon, and they find the truth together. Because that would be pretty goaded. They'll also rely on other Pokemon to broaden the scope of their investigations. Maractus in this Follow game, but I'm coping Rowling. so hard. I miss Maractus Smash so much. I haven't Darmanitan. seen Maractus since Gen Seven. Come on. Peer through walls with Luxray. Can Tim and Pikachu solve all the mysteries and find Harry? Moodoo? Why is Moodoo here? When Detective Pikachu returns. Oh on shit, Nintendo that's like Switch, three weeks. October 6th. The day before my girl's birthday. Now on Nintendo e -shop. Maybe I'll get her Detective Pikachu. <laughs> she doesn't even play that this game. This game's a real toot. Toot. <laughs> 
Raise your brass for the quirky rhythm game Trombone Champ. Play the notes in time. I'm not gonna the lie, they're kind of trash at this. But how you play that? How are you missing you? that? Da, 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 da. Am I going pitch, to get DC and or DM or whatever? Y'all know what I meant. On the right Joy-Con controller. Ooh, that's nasty. The controls are pretty unique. What? And mastering every control scheme. That's disgusting. Walk in the park. Use like the the Pump infrared camera on the right Joy-Con. Oh my classical, God. To How? And Everything I don't like between. that, bro. I don't like Plus, that. How the hell you? I mean, I, I can't even blame the homie for being trash at it. Cause what are those controls? Trombone champ slides onto Nintendo yeah, Switch. I don't. I don't know today. anyone who's buying that. Prime. Battle Fuck. your way to victory in these Nintendo Switch games. Oh my God! Wait, wait, something. Ten what? teams of three will duke Got it out a for survival game? in this online battle royale brawler. Little Knock crush? your opponent's health down to zero and deliver a finishing blow. Yeah, I'm not in the League of Legends type or games. The the only reason I play Unite is because it's Pokemon. Choose from 15 heroes, each inspired by a different mythology. Work with your allies to be the last I like team that, like, standing. that purple raven? That's Battle clean. I like that character. And launches first for consoles on Nintendo Switch next spring. A close beta test will Damn, be Damn, why is everything coming out in October. spring? It said it focus on games coming out in winter, winter not damn spring. In this open world tactical RPG. Is this? Oh, shoot on games. I was about to say, is this square? From Speaking of square, they need to the stop being a bunch of bitches and figures. give Modelith the rights to Zeno Gears. They're obviously not doing gear anything with it. They just keep using Zeno Gears and stuff but not doing anything with the IP the just like recently there's a tweet about um world. I'm like War Tales, Final Fantasy rhythm game got like a Xeno Gears Later pack today. where it brought over three Xeno Gears songs but that's it only three songs in this reimagining but of the they oh NES classic, that's cool Contra, Contra but they can't give us a goddamn Xeno Gears remake or just at the very least a goddamn port please Spring into Square isn't doing shit with Gears, and, and they obviously won't let Monolith use the IP options. for like lore this reasons or references. At least Bando let them use Xeno Saga for weapons. stuff, even if they didn't give them the Enemies. rights, they're allowing them to use it. But Powerful Square's a bitch, attack. and they're just not doing shit with and Gears. Come on, bro. Contra. Operation Galuga. Fuck, Storms I just want to go back and watch Nintendo that side order trailer. That's all I've been thinking about, bro. They did not have to drop it off rip. First thing Liberate of the direct kingdom. is side order. Your That's what I wanted. Now the rest of the direct I don't care about. Does but they're saving something for the final, the very end, bruh. They're gonna announce a new Star Fox. Or Xeno Saga. Please, something. Give me something. Pikmin 5. Pikmin 5. Xeno Blade X port. Or hell, even X2. That is the ring of the unicorn. Ancestral treasure of Cornea's royal lineage. Legends We're about halfway through this direct. Wielding it to purify uh, evil. And still nothing the that I care about now. except the path before Peach Showtime. Princess Peach Showtime. That was cool. It. I like that. And obviously side order. order. That's about it. That's tough. Freely I only got two things. I normally have world. a couple. Throughout the direct, only have two. Forge your bonds. Also, was that the Black the Eagles symbol? Glorious victory. Insignia, Cultivate whatever. A grand army with over sixty unique characters. Is this a color? And elves to massive beasts and heavy. Is this angels. a square game? Today, I wasn't paying attention to the name the and the developer. This looks like a square own. game. It may take days, months, or even years, but I shall see the duties of my bloodline fulfilled. Atlas. Oh, oh Atlas. This is an Atlas game. Of tactical fantasy RPGs. Bro, we don't want this. Give us SMT6. SMT6. Localize SMT if. Localized SMTF. Oh my god. Oh my god. And imagine. Hello, neighbor. I kind of figured it'd be Luigi, but like, no, nah, this looks too modern and like suburban for that. But Luigi's Mansion 4, we just got three. Like, 
What? Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. Oh. I mean, it's still Welcome mansion, but. Welcome to Evershade Valley, a place that's screaming and teeming with the supernatural. <laughs> Luigi, our faint of heart hero, was sent here to check Fucking it hate out. Luigi. All thanks to Smash. Like, I used to like man. Luigi more than Mario, but Smash just ruined him for me. I fucking hate Luigi no now. He's so stupid. I hate him. Vacuum like device, the Poltergust. Use it to light up dark areas, vacuum up objects, and interact with the environment. It's a handy tool for your paranormal escapades. Plus, when you spot a ghost, pop! You can stun them with the strobe ball, then vacuum them up. You can even grab multiple ghosts at once. In this game, you'll find Ghosts Haunting, a former plant research lab, a broken down clock factory that's full of sand, a mine covered in ice and snow, Ooh, and even more places. I like that places. snow area. These troublemakers will use every trick in the book to block your path. Can Luigi summon his courage and save Imagine the day? Imagine if those balloons were just Kirby's. That'd Looking be kind of funny. Other ghost hunters? Up to four players online. You can play can online? Exercise across different multiplayer modes. And you get cool fits with it too. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD. Later today. To Nintendo Switch next summer. Okay, goddamn, everything's in the spring and summer. This ain't winter. How was that? Next, we have two announcements to share. Oh shit. Oh fuck. First, please take a look at this video. Oh my god. Two announcements. Oh my god. Damn, bro. What's with all this Mario shit? We have enough. We have enough. Give me Zeno Saga, please. I need Zeno Saga. It's a large question block. Actually, this question block currently appears on the roof of the previously announced Nintendo Gallery that's under construction in Uji City, Kyoto Prefecture. Whoa! The official name of this gallery that's cool. will be the Nintendo Museum. Ooh, that's cool! What? At the oh, Nintendo it's only in Museum, Japan, though. A wide variety of Nintendo products from the company's history. So they got a Xenoblade section? No, they don't, but... Well. Ooh, I want to see the Splatoon section, bro. I mean, they have to. Splatoon is one of their we'll like biggest IPs right now, especially with how well Splatoon 3 sold. They're definitely looking at it, and with how Next, great side order is like looking. Share some updates on upcoming Amiibo figures. <gasps> Noah and Mio? Oh, bro, please! I need the Noah and Mio figures. On the Noah and Mio Amiibo. An Amiibo figure yes! Noah yes! and Mio from the Xenoblade. Oh, let's go! We got Xenoblade. Even if it's just the Amiibo, we got Xenoblade. 2024. January finally, 19th. We have a new amiibo figure to announce. Oh shit, we got a release date. Smash Sephiroth. Wait, well, he already got his. Sora yeah, I'll figure. Okay, Kingdom I was about to say it's Sora. He's the, the only character that hasn't With gotten it yet. Sora, everyone is here from Super Smash Look, it's Brothers Mithra. We see Mithra down there. Please look forward to its release next oh, year. Oh man, Mio figure, Mio amiibo, amiibo. That's all for today's amiibo announcements. Okay, I was about to say it. Next, please take a look at. Like this. I said, that's all for today's Nintendo Direct. I'm like what? Oh god, oh god. F Zero, yeah. It's it's an okay. People were calling this a new F Zero game. It's gonna be like F Zero HD. Returns as a ninety nine okay. This is not what I was expecting. I mean here's the F Zero, not what people wanted, but at least they got something. Machines from the original Super NES game. Okay, so it's an F Zero like Battle Royale. But Not really, careful. but like, Your power you know, meter will decrease an online you crash into pilots or guardrails. If it hits zero, crash in the pilots. Out. Yeah, you're you to like most people are out off right. Meter to stay in the race. Feeling risky? I mean, Spend this ain't the F zero people wanted, but at least speed. they got some. Shit, at least they got some. You can also collect super sparks, which appear when machines collide to boost up to a special path called the Skyway. It's your best chance at bypassing your rivals and jumping That's into a higher dope. position. Complete goals while you're racing to I unlock like, care about this absolutely zero about 
but I mean, I guess. Or maybe they're just doing this and then they're gonna announce, hey look, new F-Zero game. And this is just to, you know, give people hype. Nine players, one winner. It's time to race your way to first place. Because F-Zero 99 will be available exclusively for active Nintendo Switch online members the music is catchy though. Today. I mean, there's y'all F-Zero. <laughs> <laughs> Not what y'all wanted, but... years after its original release, F-Zero is back like as a Battle Royale years? game. This title also supports the Super NES controller available exclusively for Nintendo Switch Online members. That's funny. Hope you will give it a that's try funny. And Not the F-Zero place. people wanted, but okay, that's funny. let's continue with some more headlines. Yes, please. One Damn it. Hero, one that's not Prime 2 problem. or 4. Wait, what if at the very Welcome end of the direct, City, for the last trailer, they drop a Prime 4 gameplay trailer, and then they, oh, dropping gets a little too wild. <laughs> available the later today. The They're not going to shadow drop it. They're chaos. not. But, bruh, it's you, if it's coming out next year, holy fucking shit, that's huge. Because it's been six years since it was announced. And, and the then, like, what, three or four? As you continue three years? And crafting, uh, or you maybe two years. Three or two, two or three years since, of the skill tree. you know, development was restarted. Your experience even further so, by embarking on quests and hosting festivals so, for the so, I mean, can you save I think City? to even, and like, come out next year, that's huge. Because it means it's real. But F4 is actually real. They didn't forget Vandal about it. They didn't just change their mind and be like, you know what? Fuck it. We don't want it. We don't feel like making it anymore. But wait, did you hear that? Join best friends, new new what? and Willem on a journey okay, across yeah, the but, um, wilds of the Freljord. If we even get a Jump, gameplay trailer of Prime 4, climb, that's huge because it means the game is real. They're still working on it. They haven't scrapped it. Land. I really Every hope it's not stuck in development hell like Dread was. Because that, that shit took 15 years to come out. Song of Nunu, and what is all these League of Legends Legend stories? Story launches on the Nintendo I don't care Switch about this. November 1st. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. That's cool. Prime. Let's move Damn it, bro. Come on. We're getting all these Wario games, but no Metroid. Didn't we just get a new Wario game like two, three years ago? Or am I this thinking about this? Contains tons of micro games that'll get your body moving. All right, bro. In each micro game, you'll get into a specific pose called a form. Copy the form shown, then perform the correct action as quick as you can. What the hell? <laughs> That's funny. Oh, cool. oh, okay. It's like the micro games will come use the one camera. Another, They're actually so using the cameras on the Joy Cons. What's the this and like that, Plus, that trombone game were like the only ones that have used that, as far as I know. Reach the goal without getting caught by Medusa. Freeze. Medusa. Or Looks like Dora the Grey from DQ11. Speaking of DQ, closing. are we gonna get a trailer for DQ12? Holy shit, that's that's been forever too. I forgot about plenty. that. Everyone's in for a wacky time. And when the hell is DQ3 HD dropping? Because I remember we got a trailer, but did we ever get a release date? Is that out? No, because, you know, DQ3 HD? I want DQ12. That's not DQ. Lead an army of over 100 heroes yeah, into that battle. This is a square game, right? To an empire's invasion. 505? Yudian Meet Noah, Industries? A humble villager. Noah? Hmm. Say, an officer from the Empire, and Marissa, a forest guardian. Marissa. These three band together to fight for a common goal. Francesca. On their journey, they'll meet a variety of heroes who can join their cause. This is your side order trailer, bro. I can't stop thinking about it. Of course, that I have to fucking work today. Why does everything available. always have to happen when You'll I have work? Of course, crops, I direct the day I work. Now, more. work's gonna take so Each long because I'm just gonna be thinking about side order all day. Fuck. Oh my god, I want to go back they and watch that so bad. Get along at first, but these conflicts god, I need to go back and watch that trailer. Oh my, I'm gonna analyze that. I'm going to analyze that trail. Justice. And truth. A heroic tale will begin. Oh my god. 
when Ayuden Chronicle 100 Heroes launches on Nintendo Switch April 23rd. Participate in some pixel perfect play. Next stop, Octopia. Travel to a charming parallel world in this paid DLC for Eastward. Help Sam and John turn the pages of a new chapter as they adjust to country life in a mountainside village. Tend to livestock, whip up culinary delights for your neighbors, and restore buildings to help the village thrive. And if you're new to Eastward, don't worry. You can access the DLC even if you haven't played the main story. Eastward Octopia ventures onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Get back into the groove. In this sequel to War Groove, charge across three tactical campaigns with valiant factions, including a new mouse folk faction, the Fari. Plus, you can now supercharge your commander's groove to unleash devastating So apparently attacks. the DLC isn't we canon? Like offensive in conquest mode. I mean, like, side order, apparently it's not canon? Battle friends locally or online. Oh, oh, this is telling the story of what would have happened if Marina won. And, and the game was based on order. So, I mean, I'll still write about War that, Group but... Two marches on to Nintendo Switch that's actually so cool. October 5th. That's actually so cool. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. But that still doesn't explain what happened to Marina. Dive and catch fish by day. Then serve them as sushi by night in the aquatic adventure, Dave the Diver. Even if it's not valid, what happened to Pearl? And where's Use Marina? The you've caught to and that recipes was definitely and dead the fish. Day's menu. Then tend to the clamoring customers at your sushi restaurant. Explore an ever-changing underwater world to find the best ingredients and strive to exceed culinary expectations. Dave the Diver launches first for consoles on the Nintendo Switch system October 26th. Pre-orders and a free demo swim onto okay. Nintendo eShop um, later today. Fuck. Prime. The final wave is Bro, racing we don't in. care about Here's Mario Kart. God damn it. The final wave of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC. From the Mario Kart Wii game, Daisy Circuit. More returning characters are also being added in Wave 6. From the Mario Kart Double Dash game, Wave Diddy 6? Kong. I thought there was only five From waves. Mario Kart Wii, Funky Kong. From the Mario Kart Tour game, Pauline! And also, Peachette! Yeah, I definitely gotta make a, a, a trailer analysis. So wait, how the fuck does he know that side order isn't canon? Or have I been sleeping on some information? How am I missing this? Expansion pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. The DLC can also be purchased on its own. At least I got like the whole Chaos Order thing. Something new is among us. Bruh, really? Who wants this? Who wants this in a manga sequel? Wait, they make it to land now? No more ships? They're playing on islands now? I don't know how the fuck fungus like infects a ship like that and now they're all fucking dead oh it's just a new map Bungle. This new map for Among Us is free and launches this October. Bro, how the hell are we getting a new map for Among Us but no prime? What did you think? Oh, 
Thanks for sticking with us this far. Thank you. Oh. Next up, we'd like to recap some of the previously announced Nintendo titles you can oh. look forward to playing from September onwards. Damn. Let's take a look. Okay, they're recapping some stuff we already know about. Yeah, this is out. Yeah, I love that, bro. I already beat Pikmin 1 and 2. Of course, I love that series. And Pikmin 4. I beat Pikmin 4 not too long ago. The game's amazing. I beat Olimar Shipwreck Tail yesterday, actually. Incredible. Show me side order. I like Showtime. Show me side. Oh, there it is. Look at it, bro. Fuck, it's so good. Even if it's not canon. We hope you're looking forward to these upcoming titles. Wait, Prime. This next video will be our last announcement. Prime. Please take a look. Prime 4? Prime 4, Prime 4. Please. Fuck, another goddamn Mario game. Galaxy 3? Bruh, no, don't tell me this is Galaxy 3. No. Paper Mario? Bruh, no way. L Direct. L Direct. Well, I mean, the plus side to not really getting anything is that there's not much to cover. So there's not a lot of shit to cover. I just really gotta cover the uh, side story stuff. And that's really about it, so. But, damn. The whole this can't be the last one. Maybe it'll pull like a Smash Ultimate. Be like, oh, just kidding. This is the real final one. I really doubt. This was just a Mario Direct. That's all it is was. Well, looks like we gotta wait till what? July? What, or February? You gotta wait till February for our next Direct. Damn, I'm kinda actually pissed now. There's nothing here. There's literally nothing except side order and Peach Showtime. But really only side order. Unless this is a thousand year door remake. Or is this a new game? Man, this direct is stupid. Paper Mario, what? You just got her little, her own little side story? Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door, originally released on Nintendo GameCube, will return with enhanced graphics. Okay, so yeah, I figured it was just Whether you played the original door. or have yet to play it, we hope you look forward to experiencing this adventure in a paper world starring Mario and friends. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. L Direct, bruh. God damn it. That was so. No way. Okay, well, let's go back and watch that uh, side order real quick. Hold on. All right, let's go back and watch this side order. Uh, the, oh my God, they didn't have to start that hard. They didn't have to start that hard with it. Okay, did they release like a separate trailer on its own? Okay, let's see, cause God, that looked so good. That looked so good. Um, do they not just have 
the uploads section god damn all these damn playlists there's uploads because i didn't get a notification maybe it's one of the first ones since it was the first thing they announced oh my god yes okay here we go here we go side order this shit looks so good they are like do a little pseudo analyze analysis here okay so this is inkopolis this okay this this looks like splatoon 2 inkopolis from like the layout but like the whole tower is over here on the right like the turf fort or no that's shoal okay yeah that that center tower so apparently this is taking place it's like an alternate this is not canon but this is showing what happens if Splatoon 3 was based on order if K um you know order team order won during the final Splatfest. This is what Splatoon 3 was gonna look like. Man, I prefer order over chaos that this looks so clean. And like it's still Agent 8, but oh this is what order would have looked like. Oh my god. And look, that's Pearl. How is that Pearl? I probably should have done this. I knew I should have watched this on my laptop so I could do like precise, precise like time, time stamps because I can only skip 10 seconds forward and backwards on Switch. But oh my God, those dualies, those new dualies, bro. Look at those. Oh my God, look at those dualies. What? They got to have like some type of special or maybe. Oh, wait, no, I was going to say or maybe we'll get like a new brand in base game but apparently this is not canon so that's not gonna happen fuck but this is so cool but if order won damn it order should have won this looks way better than chaos this looks way better than the splatlands we have now everything's all like order everything's all orderly and you know uh organized and clean and just captain order no shit but oh oh wait these enemies, that looks like a, is that a two goob? That looks like a goo tuber. And then, oh yeah, that's like little goo, that looks like the goo tuber like bubble thing. And if you look over there under that other machine, it looks like the actual tubes for it. That's a goo tuber. And what is that pink thing? Wait, that's not a goo tuber. Never mind. Yeah, like what are these fucking ghost fish? Bro, that, 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 that was clean. That frame? Where she's like summoning the damn dualies? God damn it. Order should have won. Where is it at? Right there? That's so clean. Damn, I got wrong frame, but... Oh, look at this. You got Pearl to help you, and there's like damage numbers now. That's cool. Pearl's little crown. Yeah, this is Inkopolis. Definitely. Got the, the dead reef. The dead corals. God, where is this taking place? I mean, like, bro, there's no way. There's no way. I don't care if that's act or whatever. That's dead fish. That's dead fish. Like, look at her. There's no way that's not dead fish. She looks just like that. Unless, okay, let me actually read the dialogue. You with those fish we busted. Sick them. Fight. Cool it. I'm not your enemy. Just another bystander who got sucked in. First things first, I'm act. As for Marina and me, we go way back. For real? No, we did that next time. Okay, Pearl, now check out what happened when your color chip into the what? So wait, maybe that's not dead fish. I do like the dress though. That's kind of nice. Color chip into the palette. I like hat. I like act design a lot. Okay, 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 okay. Here's where we get like actual gameplay. Barling slope floor. Okay, 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 so this is, so it's like Octo Expansion where you choose multiple levels and shit. But do we get like, do we get to explore Inkopolis as it is? And I guess this little elevator is our hub. Uh, the palette, okay. And splash damage. Okay, so. Or maybe these are upgrades. 16 floor. There's how many floors are there? Like 50? Okay, so these are different modes. But we get different rewards. 
for the boat, but the rewards are those like that currency. But do we also get these other ones, or is it just for these challenges we get those buffs? And this one looks like uh, this first one, the easy one, looks like a power defense one. I guess we have to fend off enemies. I mean, we got splat zones for the second one, so we're like in an active splat zone match against one other character, like an NPC or a bot or whatever. And then that last one, I don't know what the fuck that is. That that looks like a like a blocky sprinkler, but drone splat bomb. Okay, splash damage, run speed. Okay, okay, and we get multiple. Oh, look, that is Pearl. It was Pearl's palette. Okay, we got dualies. They got curling bomb and reef slider. That seems a bit redundant. I don't. Damn, is that a good kit? No, not for dualies. I mean, a lot of dualies have reef slider, but I don't. Dualies don't need curling bomb. Especially with Reef Slider, that's kind of weird. That's nasty. Okay, increase our ink damage, splash damage, main firing rate. Bro, we get the, our dualies get the fire like a heavy edit? No way. Ink saver main, splash radius. Okay, splash damage does more, but then we also get to increase splash radius. Swim speed up. Okay, here are different color palettes. So those are buffs. Wait, was that a crab tank? Oh my god, bro. Don't tell me. The enemies get crab tanks. Oh, wait, no, no. Okay, no, that was Pearl. I thought I saw, like, a charger line. That was, that was the Pearl bot. Um, yeah, that is a... Yeah, I thought that was a crab tank. Yeah, don't worry, I'm doing... See, look, the, the dualies look like they were upgraded. Also, the blue on the hair is so clean. The dualies look upgraded, and obviously I'm going to be doing a, a, a trailer analysis. So all of this, like, going back and forth. This UI, going back 10 seconds. The dualies, no, they look... Yeah, they look, you see, like, those boxes around it like at least over here on the left in her left hand that dually it has like that white box of light in front of the nozzle same with the other one oh, this this oh, okay and the hair color changes depending on which palettes you have also yeah you see how they like materialized in and they had those like shapes That was clean. Yeah, see, they got these like weird holograms on them. See? Like, what the fuck are those? What are those? So you get, are those like the buffs you buy? Also, the ink tank has suction cups on it, it looks like. Oh, what is this? Wait. Don't wait, is Marina the final boss? Because, okay, if I don't remember, was Pearl order for the Splatfest? Pearl was order and Marina was chaos, right? So since Pearl won, we have to fight Marina? Bro, don't tell me we have to fight Marina as the final boss. Oh no, oh no. Oh my god, this looks so good. Bro, this trailer. Oh my god, this, what? Yeah, I'm definitely doing a trailer analysis on this. Okay, that's obviously like the main, like the final area, right? At the top of the tower. This is going to be like the boss arena. And, or we have to go in there. Something's in there. Boss arena. Boss marina. Oh my God. Are oh, those doolies are so clean. Those doolies are so clean. And I love the outfit. The all white fit is so clean. I love everything, like the all white everything. Damn it, Order should have won. Order should have won. We could have had Splatoon 3 looking like this. Side order. All right, everyone is calling it like, oh, we're going to get side order stuff in the new direct. Because, you know, it was it was about that time. What? Why is this on autoplay? Um, But 
it was about that time, right? It was around, we had, you know, quite a bit of time since we last heard about side orders, so they had to give us a little something. What? And they, they had to give us a little something. But, uh, yeah, that's really about it. Holy fuck. I gotta, damn. I'm gonna, like, pseudo-analyze this until I gotta go to work. And then I'm probably going to drop, like, a full analysis video either tomorrow or a couple days after that. Either tomorrow or on Wednesday. Maybe earlier. Some, somewhere between tomorrow and Wednesday. I'll drop an analysis trailer. As, oh my god. Oh my god. But yeah, that's really about it. So, uh, shit. <laughs>